Hey guys, Charles here, and I wanted to record a quick video. One that, boy, if I would have had in my possession uh, over the last couple days, it would have saved me hours of frustration. So I figure I'd just uh, make a quick video. Um, basically, here, here's the backstory. I'm a longtime PC user, okay? I had three 22 inch monitors. Um, I want to say one was DVI, one was VGA and one was DisplayPort. And the DisplayPort was my primary, the DVI was my secondary, and th thirdary, if that's a word, it was just a monitor that was there. Uh, I had a three monitor mount and I never never really used it. So, but, but it was there, so I couldn't tell you if the VGA was good or not, but it's what I use. But anyway, so here I go, I come home, and I look at this MacBook Air, and I see this port here, which is called a display port or a Thunderbolt, I'm not quite sure if there's a difference. Um, then the old USB port, and then you go and you look on the other side, which is here, and I have another one USB port. That's it, folks. Two USB ports. Um, you know, like I'm sitting there with my network cable going, where, where does it go? And then I realize, haha, it's wireless only. So, um, and I understand this is an error, it's not a pro, whatever, just again, just, just, I'm learning, right? So, uh, I go on Amazon and I buy, you know, $200 worth of adapters and cables and stuff, and of course, I need it, like, tomorrow. So I get it all overnight. Uh, it doesn't get here till the night, but whatever, I got it. And of all the cables and all of the adapters and all the conversions, only one worked. And the only thing that worked on this laptop was the one that went into here. Um, at the, you know, so I was like, huh, so I can have one monitor. So I start looking into it, looking into it, going, man, I have three monitors, right? I can live with two, right? Worst case, I can turn the third one into an Apple TV. I'm not overly worried about it. And I look, it doesn't have HDMI, so there goes that idea. But, you know, still, I can swap it out. So I'm sitting here going, how do I get my other two monitors to work? And I got a hold of a display port. So one of the cables I bought was display port to um, uh, Thunderbolt here. And that worked. Uh, but it was a 22 inch monitor and I felt like I was not getting the, like I can't function with one monitor. It's first world problems I know, but, that, but that's just me. So uh, I start looking into it and I start looking into it and then I realized, huh, everyone at the office Everyone who I saw, and it's the, the office is all Mac people, they all have one monitor. But boy, they're big monitors, right? So I took a gamble, and I went and I bought a, uh, and I'll show you which one, but I bought a 22-inch, no, I'm sorry, 32-inch curved monitor from Amazon. I'll bring that up uh, to be my one external monitor. And then as I researched it and I talked to other people, it turns out, you know, MacBook Airs are not really meant to have more than one. It's more of a portable machine. So, you know, whatever. So I get my monitor and plug it in, and I realize the DisplayPort cable I have is too short. So I have to go buy another one, which was a DisplayPort to HDMI, and that one works beautifully. So long story short, all the drama, you know, same-day delivery, all that stuff. I got it. We're good. Um... So right now I'm sitting staring at a 32 inch monitor that's curved, it's kind of cool. In the beginning you feel like you're in an IMAX theater, but then it just kind of, you don't notice it anymore. But what I'm finding as a Windows user, where before I needed multiple monitors, like one to have Slack and one to have other things, um, the notifications on the dock are pretty good. And this virtual desktop thing where you can swipe between desktops, that, you know, almost gets rid of the need for the extra monitors and the fact that I have the laptop monitor over there where I can put extra stuff like right now I'm staring at OBS which is what I use to record my videos um, you know I can see it so I kind of have two monitors right it's not the end of the world uh, I want the thing open anyway so I can use the touchpad um, I have bought numerous numerous toys and things like you know new keyboards and I got a touchpad coming in and all these other things because almost everything I have, nothing works with the Mac. I had a really good Microsoft camera, no good, 
had to get a Logitech. Uh, just it's crazy. Like everything I have, nothing works. Uh, but it's okay. I've gotten all new. I think I'm I'm up and running. I'm gonna be super productive now. Um, but I just wanted to kind of tell this story because boy, I could not find a video uh, that explained what I went through. So let me just kind of show you what I know worked. Now I'm sure there's people out there that says, "Oh, you didn't try the such and such adapter." I don't know, man. I bought two hundred dollars worth of adapters and stupid cables and things like that. And it just didn't work. And and this is cool. I really like the way it is. It really works for me. Um, so this now remember we talked about the uh, the laptop has two USB ports, right? Um, so for me, I'm really only able to use one, and I'll show you why. But I bought this as a as a test. It was super cheap. It's a six port. Everything else is two port. And when you look at it, the threes are in blue, the reds are in uh, red, or the twos are in red. Uh, but it works. I have my phantom microphone plugged in. I have my mouse thingy. I have my uh, Jabber headset. I have a whole bunch of things. I, I almost everyone plugged in there, and I didn't even need to power it. I may power it just because you know it doesn't come with a power, but you know it's an Android plug. I'm trying to see if it's right there. So. I can plug that in and guess, give it a little more horsepower. I don't, I don't really know what it does, but it's there. But anyway, this one worked very well for me. So if you're if you're in the same boat as me and you need like you know your keyboard, your mouse, your printer, you know all that, your your headset, all these things, that that works out well. And what's cool is some of these are spread apart. So my Phantom microphone, this guy. The USB adapter is huge. It takes up so much space. So that works very well on that. Um, the other thing I wanted to show you is the Amazon Basics cable I got. You don't realize how big it is until you plug it into the side of the laptop and realize, oh, this little plastic bezel here, like that goes around it, it creeps over to the side of the next USB port. So for this laptop, probably not the best choice, but it works. I think I can get away with a, somewhere I have these little one foot USB adapters where the USB is small, like not very big. I think I can plug that in and then plug this into it, but uh, not this, but you know, to use the other USB port, because right now I can't use it. But, uh, so that's that. So let me show you the monitor I got. So 32 inch monitor. I took a chance on it. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's not bad. Let me see. It's the Scepter. You know, I've had Scepters in the past. Uh, I'm not a big, like, this is has to be perfect kind of guy, but um, boy, I can see the screen. It looks great. And the monitor is cool as snot, man. Like, when you look at it, it is definitely curved. Um, the back of it has... Um, DisplayPort, HDMI, and VGA, right? So I could technically turn this into an Apple TV if I wish and use it for that. Um, haven't tested the audio. I don't know. I don't care. But uh, I just wanted to kind of just kind of show you what I have. Um, so yeah, so that, that's my story. I'll link the things I have in the uh, in the comments or you know in, in the description. I don't know. It just worked for me, right? This is I'm I'm pretty happy with it. You got my one monitor. Just, just know, man, some of these adapters, like if I search on uh, USB to uh, display port, right? This thing, it's so funny. I, I just don't read, I guess. But I bought one. I bought this one, Amazon's Choice. It says it's $100. It was on sale for $54. I was like, I have to buy it. Click. And then uh, this is one of the many adapters I bought. You know, I'm looking words, 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 words. Everything looks good. The one thing I did not see was this little line right here. Currently not compatible with Sierra uh, 10.12. So didn't work for me. But think about it. If I had it, where the heck would I plug it into? <laughs> right? Maybe the port? Now I'm converting and I don't know. Things I've seen online is if you use adapters and, and, and splitters and all that stuff, you just kind of lose quality and that's the last thing I want to do right I have this Mac because I want to be powerful and I want to do really cool things and help a lot of people so uh, 
I just said, eh, I, I went away with it. I went with the one monitor. I think I'm pretty happy with it. So if you have any questions, let me know. Comment if you think this video is total garbage, whatever. Just move on. But, you know, if you like it and it helped you, let me know. Right? I'm not this big YouTuber. I'm just kind of making a quick video for anyone who comes across my scenario. So, all right, guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.